Hey, what is up everyone? Welcome back to the channel. Um, welcome to those who are already subscribed to the channel and um, hello to those who haven't yet subscribed and who are new. I do appreciate you stopping by and checking out this video. Um, if you haven't already subscribed, be sure to check out my New Year sub goal. It's not actually for next year, it's the year after. So 2020, I'm hoping to at least reach 1,000 subscribers. I think that's a realistic target and need you guys to help me out with that. But only subscribe if you enjoy my content and yeah, hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload new videos and when I go live. Okay, so in today's video, literally going to be taking a trip down memory lane all the way back to the beginning of this year. Um... Yeah, so challenged myself. Um, I've never had a fight in my life. So I saw this advert on Facebook. It was a charity event called Ultra White Collar Boxing. And um, it was coming to my local town. And um, I'd never had a fight or boxed in my life. Um, when I go to the gym, every now and again, I like, throw a few punches at the bag. But never ever done any book any kind of fighting training any boxing training so but i wanted to challenge myself and yeah every year i like i wanted to do something new so last year i went on holiday on my own in fact i ended up having three holidays and this year i had a fight <laughs> but it was for charity and it was for a really good cause um i did it for my grandma betty who sadly passed away lost her life to cancer, uh, breast cancer, sorry. Um, so yeah, what we're going to do now is um, I'm going to show you guys the video of my fight and just basically react to it, explain to you guys what was literally going through my head, my body at that time. Um, and also, we had eight weeks of training and the training was very intense, but... Um, it was the experience the overall experience was just absolutely phenomenal and you can't really explain it to be honest because it's scary i could say it's scary but once you're in that moment it's just on a whole other level um but enough talking crap now i'm actually going to i uh, did have the video up it's somewhere i've lost it now um downloads here it is. Need some sound. Okay, so this was at Sheffield. Right, so before we go any further, sorry, I don't want this video to be super long, but as you can see, we had to choose a fighting name. Everyone like went for the typical sort of like, well, I was against a guy called Simon the Beast James. Was, I don't know. People had to come up with their own fight names. So I came up with Joe Jalfrazy Curry because my surname is Curry. Hence why my YouTube channel is called Jalfrazy. <laughs> I don't know. It's It probably sucks to be honest. But uh, oh well. I like it. But yeah. I'm not talk too much. I'll just let you guys enjoy the video. As you can kind of see, I'm, I mean, I hate watching this, to be honest, because I just feel like I'm a bitch. I'm, like, cowering a lot. Probably just... It's as though I'm like, oh, please don't hit me, please don't hit me. And that's what, that was basically going through my head. I didn't want to get hit in the face. It's not a nice feeling. But I'll let you guys be the judge. Let me know in the comments down below who you think deserve to win. Right, so bear in mind, this is an amateur boxing event. So we only get three two-minute rounds. 
And at this point, I'm already knackered within like the first 30 seconds. So I don't think we had any volume on then. I had to... Oof! <laughs> that was a good little contact there. Um, I had three of my family members come to support me. And an old friend from a previous, from a previous job. So unfortunately I couldn't get a lot of friends to come and support me which was a shame oof I got him good there didn't I honestly you, you could just see how pumped I am I'm just like I wanted it to be over and done with here we go ah oh, sorry you guys out of my control. He didn't get to see the ring girl, I'm afraid. She was fit, though. So, eight weeks of training preparing for this one night. Absolutely unbelievable. It took so much dedication. Like mentally and physically, it challenged me. I don't want you guys to judge me by my technique, okay? As I said, it was it's an amateur boxing fight. This guy I'm fighting now, he did this same event the previous year or so. So he had experience on me. The guy was also older as well. I can't remember by how much, but I weighed heavier. I think I was like 95 kilo. And I'm pretty sure he was like eight, maybe 85. Quite a lot of difference in weight. But he had experience and a lot better technique than I did. So if anything, he deserves to win, right? What are you guys thinking right now? I do apologise for the lag. I'm recording this with OBS. <laughs> Unbelievable. Right, so were you surprised? This event is like running it again for next year. So it's a UK event. If anybody is from the UK and they fancy taking up this charity event, then yeah, it's called Ultra White Collar Boxing. It's literally, it takes place all around the UK. So yeah, sign up to it. You get eight weeks of free training. So it's, if you want to lose weight, if you want to support a family member, a family friend or anything, then go for it. Um, but to safely say I'll never do it again it was an absolutely incredible experience but I could just never do it again what I'm just recording a video what what found what right Need to move out.
well there's not much, much else to say anyway so I uh, hope you enjoyed the video and um, give it a like subscribe if you're new to the channel mom he's still there well, I'm not landing, cold out. right